welcome back to my channel welcome back to week 10 of baby led weaning i cannot believe it um so i have actually done pretty well with meals this week if i do say so myself um and i've cut it down to quite a short video so i hope you enjoy this if you do want to see longer ones then please let me know because i can obviously make them longer um but on this day she had um tomatoes broccoli and some puree um which as you can see the broccoli wasn't it for her she did not like it but it's really fun just like watching her make that face <laughs> um she was smiling though look at her oh <laughs> 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 I do honestly try to make baby led weaning as fun as possible so I do encourage laughter just because I want her to think that this is fun because it is fun um, so yeah I will show you some videos coming up of me doing an aeroplane <laughs> honestly loved the um puree and she just loved that airplane thing but yeah so on this day we gave her sweet potato raspberries and peas so i mixed the peas in with the sweet potato and it didn't go as well as what i was ex as expecting but that's okay um and raspberries she just wasn't keen i don't think <laughs> um this was a really stressful day though because chris was feeding the rabbits in the living room and i had to take her into the kitchen so i was just working with what i had basically um, but we did also have TV on for her just so she could watch because uh, it was just crazy. It was a crazy night. And then that following day, I think I fed her too late and she literally just threw it all up. So not ideal. Don't feed them too late. That wasn't clear. I mean, I fed her that day too late. So then the following morning she was sick. So I actually gave her ready breakfast for the first time this week, which was really exciting because this was like a proper meal. Um, and I think she really liked it. So this was her first time having oats and... I so far think that they're okay with her. There is agreeing. Yeah. Um, again, this was a really fun video. <laughs> Good girl. I just absolutely love being a mum. I love watching them grow and I love watching her laugh. So this day I gave her ready break bananas and these blueberry wafers. Now I did not give her this much ready break. This actually went over uh, this day and then the next day. But I just ended up making too much and I just saw what she was having. I'm also trying to give her more water now. We've got another sippy cup. Would you like some more? Okay. You would like some more? I was saying we've got another sippy cup and she's definitely using that one better than the other one. I think the other one was a munchkin one, that's Tommy Tippy. Um but yeah, I'm encouraging water with every meal now. <laughs> 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 So as well, if anyone is wondering, I'm now giving her two meals a day um, and a snack if I can. So this one we had um, Greek yogurt, banana, and I actually gave her a fish finger. Now, I know some people might sort of question that or be like, is that really something you should give? I know there's a lot of different opinions out there for baby led weaning and what different parents do. But we were having um, like some chicken fishy type thing and... They always say like to give her what we're having and I wouldn't normally do that with just random food but because a fish finger is like kind of fishy like kind of has some nutrients in I thought I'll give it a go um and this was her first actual thing like I don't know how to explain it but I've not given her anything proper um and now that she's had that I'm definitely going to do mince this week because I didn't get around to doing it this week but I think she actually loved it she ate it a lot better than what I thought she would um but yeah I'm really happy with how that went and then I just gave her a banana and I just gave it to her now and sort of watched her eat it and she just she's really good at eating banana 
Um, but yeah, that was that. And then this is another day and I gave her avocado on toast with some strawberries and some blueberries. So blueberries are new to her and she has had strawberries before, but she loved both of them, um, which I'm really happy about. The avocado, I think she just loves anyway. She's really, she's had avocado for quite a few quite a few times now god i can't get my words out <laughs> um it's too late at night but yeah so she enjoyed that and she's really good at like picking things up i think i mean this took a bit of time but she's concentrating hard um but that was that and yes even though she's had strawberries before i definitely think that this was a better round of that and i don't know if maybe the strawberry was better or she'd just been used to it but it was definitely a better better time this time if that makes sense to you guys you can watch her eat it look she loved it and here's a laughing video coming up which is great yeah. so yeah i think you can learn to an extent but also because yeah. it makes me laugh so much <laughs> But also, um, a couple of tips for you guys. So if you are planning on giving your baby fish fingers, like I did, um, go for the cod ones instead of the Omega-3. Um, and also, if your baby is, or you think is struggling with some, like, fruit, go try and do seasonal fruit because it might actually taste better because it's, like, in season, if that makes sense. Um, I actually got told that tip the other day and I thought, actually, that's a really good point. But um, here's her having her water again. She absolutely loved it. She just kept wanting more and more. You can see Reggie in the background. <laughs> anyway, we are coming to the end of the video now. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a like and comment below as it really supports my channel. And did I say channel or channel? <laughs> um, and also, if you don't already, then please subscribe. As, yeah, I have new videos coming out every single week. So I don't want you to miss them. See you later, guys. Bye.